He's a former mixed martial artist who made a living knocking out his opponents in the ring. Now he's trying to knock them out in a different arena, local politics. As Orange County reporter Tony Cabrera tells us, not everyone is cheering for this ex-athlete's political ambitions. One of the biggest names in UFC history will soon appear on the ballot in Huntington Beach. MMA star Tito Ortiz is one of 15 city council candidates. I'm not a politician at all. You know, I'm, I'm an American that was born and raised here in Huntington Beach. That I'm going to fight for my community. They've given so much to me of my career in mixed martial arts of 23 years. Now it's time to give back for them. The 45 year old thought about the decision back in June during the Black Lives Matter protests. He said he showed up not as a counter protester, but to protect his city from anyone trying to burn it down. When I stood down here, I wanted to be a police officer, but come to realize if I was going to be a police officer that uh, my hands would be tied because of the sheriff or because, because of the chief or the lieutenant of, uh, of the officers. and. So let's get into the opposite side of uh, for city council. A lot of his inspiration comes from President Trump, who also made the move from celebrity to politician. I'll give a lot of credit to Donald Trump because he was not a politician. He was a businessman who had a business strategy to make America great. Will I ever run as president? I will not. Nope. But uh, I think the Trump family has that uh, handled 100%. Uh, you'll see the first uh, woman president, Ivanka Trump. Uh, mark my words. We reached out to the other 14 candidates for comment. Some were supportive of his decision to run, saying, I have the utmost respect for Tito running for political office and I think it is great that Tito has become civically engaged in our community. I understand the motivation to give back and protect our home for our future generations. Others criticize his move saying the only time I've seen him in recent years is on TMZ or standing on the side of known hate groups protecting HB from peaceful protests. And while some are using their celebrity status and wild QAnon conspiracy theories to advance themselves politically and personally, I will continue my work in the community to feed the hungry, find housing for the displaced and fight for environmental justice. With another writing, our culture has fallen in love with the idea of celebrity and our media has fueled the confusion of celebrity and leadership. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV and Roku to watch on your TV.